Hey, I am Folygon, and welcome back to my series of short videos where I create a 3D character doodle with some fun, snappy editing to show off the coolest parts of the process. Click that subscribe button if you are new around here, and check out the links in the description for things like my Patreon, brushes, and tutorials. In this video, I'll be creating a digital sculpt of Disney's Cruella. With this sculpt, I decided to start from a base head that I recently created. I'm working on a new tutorial for my patrons about understanding and sculpting the planes of the head, one of, if not the most important things you need to understand to sculpt a nice character. I thought it would make for a good starting point to help speed up my process, and it definitely was. I love creating everything from scratch as often as I can, but when you've done that as many times as I have, it's not necessarily a waste of time, but it's nice to work smarter, not harder. However, I will say that if you are newer to sculpting or you just want to improve in general, you should still create everything from scratch so that you can practice the most difficult parts of the process. Unless it's for work, then anything is fair game. So I just saw this movie a few nights ago and I did really enjoy it, but I may have forgotten some of the details about the original 101 Dalmatians movie. Which isn't even necessary to see this flick, but I totally thought that Perdita, the mother of the Dalmatians, gave birth to 101 puppies in the original movie. Apparently she only had 15 and then they discover more at Hell Hall, which is Cruella's mansion, but I thought you guys would enjoy that little peek behind my mental curtain, so to speak. Still definitely worth a watch in my opinion, even if you haven't seen 101 Dalmatians, or if you misremember some of the details and haven't seen the movie in well over two decades like myself. But anyway, back to the sculpt here, I had a lot of fun experimenting with the hair in this one just to see how rough I could make it and still have it read as hair. I got in there with my clay brush and just made an absolute mess. Not my normal style there for sure, but these are just meant to be quick doodles that I make to intersperse my larger month-long videos. New one of those is coming soon, by the way, and if you want to see some behind the scenes on that, you can of course check out my Patreon, there's a link down below. But hey, hope that you guys enjoyed the video here. If you did, click that like button and check out my last one where I made Sam the Samsung Girl. And with that, you guys have a great rest of your day, and I will see you in the next video.